Hello everyone. Today we are going to walk you through installing Reach on Windows. First thing you need to do is make sure that you have the latest version of Windows 10. It needs to be at least version 2004 or higher. Go ahead and use your Windows update to make that happen. Next, you need to enable the Windows subsystem for Linux. Recently, Microsoft released WSL2 that has made this process so much easier. To, en to enable WSL2, First, you need to open up your PowerShell and you need to open it in uh, as an administrator. Once you have it open, you can copy this line and paste it in. Next, you need to enable the virtual machine platform. Copy this and paste that in. And then finally, you need to set your default version of DSL to the, uh, the, the WSL to WSL2. Now, once that's all done, the next step is to install Docker. I'm going to go ahead and close my PowerShell. Actually, sorry. The next step is to install your, uh, your actual Ubuntu or whatever Linux version that you'd like. I'm going to go ahead and start and choose Ubuntu. I'm going to choose Ubuntu 20.04. Go ahead and open up the Microsoft Store and click install. Once that's installed, you can launch it. Takes a little bit to boot up for the first time. Once it is, you can set up your Unix username and your password. And now you have Ubuntu. For now, we're gonna close this down and now we're actually gonna install Docker. I've previously downloaded the install for Docker desktop. So we're gonna open this up. Make sure that we're enable the WSL2 Windows features. This will take a few minutes, so I'll probably fast forward this through in the video. Great, now that that's done, I need to make sure that Docker is actually running. So I'll start that up. And then while Docker's starting up, I'll start Ubuntu. Close this out. Now we have everything that we need to install to, or we have everything installed to be able to install Reach. And I'm gonna go ahead and just do those next steps for you as well. So I'm gonna jump to the, the install initialize portion of the tutorial. Just confirm that I do have Docker installed. Perfect. I'm going to um, go ahead and make a developer folder. Into that. And once I'm in here, I'm going to copy the install uh, script and paste this in here. Looks like I need to enable my copy and paste. Oh, sorry there. So. See if try that one more time. All right, let's start that. Now we have reach uh, installed on this lot in this directory. I can show that by typing a version. And then of course I can also go ahead and download the reach Docker image as well by typing in reach update. takes a about a minute to fully download and install and then just go ahead and confirm that it is installed correctly 
Perfect. There you go, uh, installing Reach from beginning to end um, on Windows.